Hi folks, this is Clavino of OpenMV, and today I just wanted to talk about the new OpenMV Cam RT. We just got our prototype samples back, um, and we've been able to test and verify a lot of things on board. Uh, so far, many features are working, and so we're excited to be able to go to the next step of prototype production and do one more sample run before we're ready to start mass production, hopefully in July. Anyway, here's the new board. We got most things right on it. There's a few mistakes, but so far the battery charging is functional, uh, SD RAM is functional, flash is functional, processor is functional, and even the Wi-Fi is functional. Uh, we also tested Ethernet and that works too, and now I'm going to show you a demo. Okay, so now we're streaming data from the new OpenMV Cam RT. I'd like to get a huge shout out to Ibrahim for his amazing work on getting this operational. Uh, just keep in mind, everybody, that we're running all of our code on a whole new architecture. It's the same Cortex M7 processor, but we're, you know, everything's different from the camera image, image capture to uh, how SDRAM works and all these other various things. Uh, the firmware is still in a pretty fragile state, so uh, Ibrahim's getting things booted up. But so far, we've got USB working, and this is now USB high speed, so... Uh, frames are coming out a lot faster. This means you won't see any performance issues with dumping JPEGs anymore. And we've got the camera streaming from the OV5640 um, at VGA to the processor. Um, note that the data bus there is running at about 80 megahertz, and so we're at the same speed as the uh, OpenMV Cam H7. And so slowly but surely, we're getting all the firmware pieces working to make this as capable as the OpenMV Cam H7 and more. Uh, so anyway, yeah, right now we've got VGA streaming. Uh, currently the firmware doesn't seem to support the SDRAM right now, so I'm not going to be able to show you a high res, but I can show you a few demos that, you know, features are functional. So let's try out some QR code detection real quick. So holding these guys up right here, you know, this is how we test sometimes. Um, we're able to see the cameras. Oh, let me pull up some easier ones. Hold on. Uh, able to see the camera is able to detect these and find these two QR codes with the payloads. Um, let's see what they're saying. Hello and bit.ly version. Um, anyway, so yeah, we've got these basic features running. Um, they're running at about the same performance as the H7. Um, and so these are operational now. Um, and yeah, it's very cool that we've managed to bring all of our code and everything else to a whole new processor architecture and we'll soon be ready to go with a new version of OpenMVCAM. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.